Let's do this. Oh my goodness. Hi. Welcome to Can of Spader Christmas. All right, this is the cart build video, but before I get to that, I want to mention one thing. Inverters have got capacitors that charge up very quickly the first time you connect them to a battery. I had to change my shorts the first time I did that. But it occurred to me that this is going to happen or potentially could happen anytime the breakers are shut off and the caps are allowed to discharge. Uh, and I wanted a way to prevent that jolt to the system just by turning everything on at once. I had a couple of big honking 10 ohm wire round resistors I put in series, which still gets a spark, but it is much smaller. Maybe I need a third one. Now, once the caps are charged, they will hold the charge long enough to make the permanent connection. So I'm thinking this rotary switch with the resistors on port one to charge the caps, one and two to connect the main power, and then two for just main power. So if they discharged, I can rotate the switch around one time and do sort of a soft start. Let me know your thoughts on this. Okay. Here it is.
There was a lot of thinking and installing, so I did a lot of this off camera, but the shunt is in the lower left, which is connected to cell pack one. The end of the string is on the lower right, and it's just a connection point for the positive side of baby pack one. Uh, Watchmon 4 is bottom center. The positive and negative go into the circuit breakers attached to the shunt trip and then coming out of there is the load side terminal blocks. The shunt is monitoring the positive side voltage which shows up as the supply voltage and the Watchmon negative is fed from the negative terminal. And it just occurred to me that I need to move that to the shunt so the Watchmon will still have power even if the breakers trip. Okay, note to self. I got this fuse block from Amazon. It's got room for four fuses, uh, which in my case will always have power. I've got the two amp, the four amp, and the four amp. Oh, this one's upside down. I need to change that. Oh, that is so much better. The top one powers the shunt trip. The second one powers the fans. And the third one powers the Watchmon 4. The last one is not connected. It actually came with a 15 amp fuse. The inverter is normally hung on a wall and it has two holes on top. So I cut a slit in the four x four so it just kind of hangs over the rail, gives it a little stability, uh, keep it from sliding around. Now the bottom of the inverter is just sitting on another four x four. Keep in mind, this is just a test setup so I don't have permanent wiring and mounting just yet. Let's do this. This is the Batrium screen. There is no load on the inverter right now, but it's just the draw of the inverter itself, the fans, um, and the Watchmon. I'm going to add a load and we'll see what happens here. Kick it up to the, let's hit it with 250 watts. Good. We're pulling 11 amps. Not even breathing. Check the wires. Everybody's happy. Batteries are okay. This is just an LED bulb, so, but I'll turn that on. Didn't really affect much. Here's a uh, compact fluorescent three hundred and sixty uh, here's a little incandescent four thirteen and we got another flood seventeen wa uh, seventeen amps almost five hundred watts Okay, like I said, I'll have to do more testing. All right, this is awesome. I didn't want to clap into the microphone. It'd be real loud. Um, okay, so 
We survived power up. Looks like things are working. I'm going to do some tests here and there, but I am going to end this video here. Um, it's probably long enough. Um, if you have any questions about what I did or any of the wiring or anything, I'll try and I, I'll, I obviously haven't edited yet, so I will try and include as much of that in there as I can or can think of. Uh, but if you have any questions, leave them below. I'll also put links to all of the bus bar and fuse block things. Uh, I got them from Amazon, so I'll put those links down in the description. Other than that, thanks for watching, and I'll see you again soon. Now, I shot an email. Uh, so I got six of these. And so they, I got five of these when I started relaxing a little bit and then BAM!